probably, you know, have strong will was yeah. what we left off with. Oh. All right, thank you. Wait, what? Ah. Sorry. My headphones just flipped off. Um Sorry, I, I'm just as confused about where we are because it moved. I had it all set up. Okay. Uh. So we'd read that page and then um Okay, we read that one. So now this is where we are. Okay. So first off is going to be um Chris. あ、話の後、また少しの間、お互い黙って座っていた。uh, this boy's always looking at that fire. <laughs> always. Nice and warm after all. Yep. Yep. Um, so after that talk, which I believe was about the family yes. stones thing. Yep. Um, so after that talk, um, we uh, once again sat uh, with each other, or sat, you know, in each other's presence uh, silently. Uh, lady entered the room and um smelled Nebri's feet uh and then uh sat in my lap so what um, also we missed out from last time with cookie is that he found a cat when he was wandering around the house and he's named that cat lady yeah oh that's nice mm -hmm. very elegant cat um mm -hmm. yeah so um so she sat in his lap and then he approached um, Nebri's chair and um, pet a uh, lady and stared at the fire. Perfect. Um, Shosai wa atatakaku takigi o hakonde tume ti hie 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 ta karada mo tsukari atatamata. So um, the the office was warm, and um, my body also became warm, even though my body was very cold from having to bring in the fire word, which happened earlier in the story. Atowa tabemono sai areba iu koto nai ga waza waza tori ni iku no wa mendo da. Um, so. After, um, even though I didn't hear anything about um, dinner, about food, um, it would be quite the trouble to go out of my way to get it. Lady wa nodo narashiteiru. Lady was purring. And next will be Cookie. Uh, nanda is like so it's like um what's this over there and then um that's what nebari said um closing the magical stone book perfect and the next line i think will also go to you okay ore wa me o Pachi pachis sasete kao ageta. So it's like um, my eyes, um, like, you know, when you close and open them yes. or when you blink rapidly? Yep. Yeah, that sort of thing. Um, that That's what happened to his eyes. And then he lifted up his face. Nice. And Chris, your turn. Mm -hmm. uh, my turn, yeah? Yep. Uh, I'm gonna look up a 
the total Yeah, I have no idea what that means either. Oh. Did I doze off? Oh, interesting. Yep. Um, could it be that I'm dozing off? Uh, lady, uh, got down from my lap and stretched. And Chris. I mean, sorry, Cookie. Chris does. <laughs> cookie, your turn. Mm. Okay. Uh, nebari wa, uh, lady o yubi sashite ka, um, neko da yo. It was like, so Nebari stroked his fingers over the cat. That's and, a really uh, good guess, but Yubisasu actually means to point at. Oh my god, how did I forget that? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, you think of a okay, Nadidu so... or maybe even Nazoru in some way. Nadidu. Okay, yeah. So, um, yeah, so he pointed at the cat and he's like, oh, it's a cat. Actually, hmm. Nekodayo is said by Khan. So, oh, yeah. everybody was like, Nanda okay. sore wa? What is that? And then uh, Khan's like, what? And so nobody points to the cat. So Khan goes, Neko da yo? It's a cat. Sore wa wakatte oru. Koko de nani o shite iru no ka to kiite oru no da. I know that. Um, what I wanted to hear was, um, what is it doing here? Or what I was asking. Um, was I wanted to make a comment about a previous line. Uh, uh, probably was one I did. It was one that, yeah, uh, is the ato wa tabemono sai Yeah, I was kind of confused by that. Um, yeah, I was, I was like, something about it wasn't clicking, and then I figured it out. Yu uh, koto nashi or yu koto nai. Um, it's a phrase, and it means not a thing one can complain about, better than oh. one could hope for. So, so it's something like I couldn't hope or I couldn't say right. Like I couldn't ask for. Oh, if only I had food. <laughs> like, I, it's not my place to ask that right now, but going to go get it would be difficult. Ah, you know, oh, that, that makes sense. Because it'd be annoying to get the food, but it's also not his place to ask nobody, hey, could you give me some food? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, that makes sense. Look at it. Hi. Um, mm -hmm. It is your turn now. Okay. Uh, where do you so Khan says, uh, she lives here. And um, before never uh, or no. No, you're right. Before nobody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The whole thing is before. Yeah, before nobody could scowl his face and say something like, "We don't need a cat." Um, I added. Uh, Bennett said that she is perfect for catching mice. Hi. Um, umu ma so kamo shiren ga. Um, I get. I guess that's fine. Perhaps that's true. Nobody wa hono waki ni oite tachiagata. Nobody puts the book to the side and stands up. Sate kozo omai mo madoseki o mitsukera nuba naranan. Okay, boy, you must find your magical stone as well. Ikkoku mo hayaku mitsukeru no da. Um, you should find it as fast as possible. And ikkoku should be like instantly. So I guess uh, as fast as possible. Yeah, um, I think ikkoku no hayaku is a whole phrase. It yep. is. Immediately. And cookie, mm -hmm. onigashimasu. Okay, so, ashita wa, um, oh. You gotta split up. You've seen this before. Yep. Majitsu dai gakko, actually. Okay. Right here is gakko. So, dai gakko. Go does not have the same meaning of daigaku because daigaku is college. Daigako is a gakko, so a school that's just like oh, well okay, equipped. Yeah. It's a so it's not college. It's it's um okay. So it's like um ashita wa majutsu daigako ni ikuzo. It's like let's go to um the magical school tomorrow. Yes. Something else you miss is that um, nobody told Khan that he's going to roll him into school because he doesn't want to teach Khan how to read. So you, you also miss that. No. So, sorry, you missed you missed a lot. <laughs> There's quite a few yep. little things going on. 
Yeah. Majutsu Daigaku would be another good name for this voice channel. Yeah. I like Majutsu To better though, because that's what we're doing. <laughs> for sure. Hi. Um, and I think the next one will also go to Cookie. Okay, there's a lot of there's a few things I might not know, but let's see. My will, uh, Kozo Niwa, yeah, Kozo Niwa, um, and then there's that bit. Oh, I can Fushigi. recognize two out of the three kanji. Yeah, I think Fushigi. it's so funny because I always thought Fushigi was a really like easy word, but it's like not for some reason for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> know, Maybe it's because I haven't anime. seen it very much. Must watch yeah. Too much anime. Plus, so, fushigi na saino ga aru. It was like, I think this is Nebari's diary. It is Nebari's mm -hmm. diary, yep. Yeah. And he's talking so about the like, kozo. Yeah, that's right. He's talking about con. Um, what does uh, fushigi mean? Fushigi means mysterious it's like, or uh, strange. Perplexing, even. Perplexing. Yeah, so the brat is a very perplexing and then sign. Mm. Um, I would look at the grammar here. We got aru and ga, which is very simple grammar right there. Kozo so it's like he ga has a lot of yes. skills or something. Yes. Yeah. So the kid has a lot of, as you said, skills. Saino means talent. So it's saying the kid has yeah. a mysterious talent. Kozo mm. niwa. So the kid has a mysterious talent. And Chris, mm -hmm. your turn. Yeah. Uh, speaking of yes. uh, just the words in here, uh, the word tensai is maybe a bit more common. Maybe you might have heard yeah. it, maybe not. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The sai is the same, right? Yes, so it is. Tensai is genius. Sai no is like, you know, good, good ability, right? Talent. So maybe yeah. that connection can help you remember it. Mm, thank you. Mm hmm. Yeah. Uh, some kind of sensing word, I would assume. Sensitive. That, Sensible. That makes sense. Uh, yes. cool. um, so, um, he reacted sensitively to it, right? He had like an acute reaction. Hi. Um, and he was able to see um, the owners of the magical stones. Hi. And that toa, I guess, is kind of hard to... And toa. toa. Yeah, it's hard to translate. I, I mean, like, that means that, you know, that kind of thing. Yeah. Um, um, gen ni madousaki no naka ni waga haha o mite. Um, just now would be my guess. Actually, actually, um, he saw my mother inside of one of the magical stones, and he called her the girl in brown. And I think Cookie can do this. Um. Hmm. This is the one that goes, um, Washi no te, no te, egamini, and then it's like, what? Thread tight. Tai Or, I guess, the only chance of. Man, Lobby Chan must be really slow because I've had that selected for a little bit. Yeah, yeah, it's, I. Okay, I'm going to start from the top. Washi no te egamini, uh, tai suru, uh, majutsu hi tachi no. And then that bit is something Henji. I've seen before, but yeah. I don't remember. Henji. Um, Henji wa uh, mada do todo ga nai. Todo so it's like my, yeah, so it's like my letter to um, the magical teachers um, has not been sent yet. Or like it hasn't been received yet. Has not been delivered yet. Delivered yet? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Exactly. So yeah, Majutsu. See, you've seen this before in this book. The specifically, you're kind of right. It means teacher, but in this book, it really just means magicians. Um, they're 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 masters of magical spells. This kind of would be like a direct translation, I guess. So she's less like sensei, but more like a master of something. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I'm not sure if you necessarily got the whole relative clauses there. Maybe, maybe you just cut out and I didn't hear right. But it's the response to the letter that I sent them has not come back. Oh. Yeah. Mm. So the henji part. is, the yeah, the tegami ni taisuru henji. Ah, oh. Taisuru confused so me too. Yeah, 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 it's like it's like two in this in this case. Yeah. If you were to say response to my letter, mm. the hint, the Taisuru is the two. Hi, mm. that makes more sense because why would he know whether or not the letter was delivered yet? <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, but rather it, it hasn't been delivered to him. Right, yes. it hasn't arrived. He has not received a letter. A response. A response to the letter he originally wrote to the magical people. Okay. <laughs> Um, Knowing those guys, um, they're probably struggling and having an argue or a discussion about um what they're even going to write in that letter and um to the extent that there's no doubt about it that they probably have just started (laughs) that it's like dinner time and they're like that's when they're like still deciding on what's going to be written in the letter yeah yeah, there were a couple of readings in there that you you messed up. I'm I'm sure yeah. you know them, but it's just like in the moment. Yeah, you said you got that instead of you shoku, and I think you said soul soul instead of soul done. Oh, you said something that wasn't soul done. Ah uh, yes, soul done. Yeah, and then uh, ageku is uh, you, you just didn't include your translation. After I, I yeah, didn't have ageku. I didn't have like after. I didn't have akite. I did ageku though. I see. I said that there does, was. Does ageku there. really mean struggle? No, aki, aki, yeah, I, ageku means after, like, a progress, like, it takes a long time, so, like, you're still struggling over making a, it, I guess, like, I guess a long pro, like, I guess. There's another word, uh, uh, oh, shoot, there's another word that means struggle that sounds really similar to it, it. I think you it. might be confusing That's them. probably is where that comes uh, from. But, yeah, akiru is uh, actually what I 100% didn't put in there, to I get think, bored of. You're thinking of agaku. Is what you're mm-hmm. thinking of. Agaku is to struggle. Yeah. But Agaku is just after all that. Uh huh. That's kind of the right. same, like context wise. Yeah, they're different kanji. Mm, interesting. Agaku and Agaku. They're, they're just, they're completely different words. Interesting. Yeah, they, they look similar. like transitive and transitive pairs, but they're not. Well, I'm just saying in English it does actually have about the same meaning. After a long yeah. process is kind of insinuating. I suppose. I, I guess like it's just like for, for like in, in America, if it takes a long time, it feels like it was a struggle. So it has like the same, same mm-hmm. room in my bread. I suppose. Yeah, because you could struggle without it being a long time and you could do something for a long time without it being a struggle. Mm-hmm. But they tend to happen at the same time. Yeah. Right. Um, last part is going to go to Cookie. Uh, ore wa majuts, uh, sorry, is it majuts she and yep. then that the itta daro and then it's like kon yori. Um, it's like, um, oh, how do I say this? It's like I spoke to, oh, well, I will. That's a good speak guess, to, but that's not actually what he's saying. It? Um, I believe. That it's not ni, so you're putting ni there. This is to. So, ori wa itta. What does that mean? Ori wa itta. I've done that before. Ori wa itta. Um, uh, so, I spoke or something? Yes. Yet? I case, said, majutsu yeah. um, <laughs> Which, as you said, is a wizard. So, this is saying, um, didn't I say it? I'm a wizard. Right? <laughs> yeah. Didn't I say I'm a wi- Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's what I believe. It, I think, saying. yeah, something that might make it more clear is that he says the date ita, right? That like uh, mm. ita is is the same thing. So mm. something date ita means I said that, right? Yeah. Right. The dato means I'm quoting myself. 
is that I said that I'm a wizard, and then Kon Yori means compared to Kon. That is what it Unlike. means. However, when that shows up in this format, it actually means from. So a common way to end letters is that less than con. Le less than is... Uh, oh, that, that's okay. part of the reason why Chris likes to remember it as from. Because you could say, from cats, mice are small or something. You know, like, it, it, mm -hmm. it, it theoretically kind of works. Even though it's an ugly English sentence, it does still, like, make sense. As using from as mm -hmm. like that's the standard of comparison. Yeah. I uh, think for me it's going to be perfectly reasonable for me to think of Yori as um, either compared to or from, but and <laughs> from only in the context of a letter. Or me a letter. There's actually one more me letter. Too. I am the same. There, with you. There's one more context actually where Yori is from, uh, where it's like undeniably you can't think of it any other way. Uh, there's so there's a. Yep, niyote, uh, in written form, or like in writing, can sometimes be written niyori. Okay. And it's it's the same yori. Okay. Now we're starting so from this. chapter 12. Wait, you can continue talking while I'm uh, highlighting this. For sure. No, no, I think I think I think I got to the end of that thought. You, oh. you get what I'm saying. So, so. <laughs> uh, hi, 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 hi. Uh, da, da. Um, first line is going to go to Chris. あ、僕実、やばりは魔術師たちがここおそらくあ、に、あ、集まる年って俺のをあ、午後、うん、いや、午後早めに魔術大学へずれて、うん、ずれていった。あ、this kind of funny. Um, so the next day, um, never probably knew that the magicians were going to meet in the afternoon. Uh, or rather, he knew that they were probably going to meet in the afternoon. Um, and he had me go early in the afternoon to the Magic Academy. Right. Uh, specifically, rather, go with him to it. So yeah, he took, he took him there. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And Cookie. Uh, yep. Um... Then choose Wait, which is word. which color is it? Uh, it's 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 just oh, yeah. the one that's left. Okay, and so how do I pronounce the first? How do, how do I read that first kanji? Uh, Benju. Oh, yeah. Uh, Lenju. Lenju. Okay. Uh, Lenju. Uh, mada washi ga kuru, uh, to wa omotte imai. Okay. I've never heard inai before. You would have never heard it before. Inai. It's the same as inai. It's just old man talking. Oh, oh yeah, that's fair. That makes sense. Yep. There's like... Uh, then she... Yeah, those guys is the best. Yeah, so those guys have not come with me yet. I think I don't think so that that is a little bit confusing as far as like particles um it it's saying those guys have kangai denai. however, this part right here, this waga is the subject of this verb kudu um mm -hmm. it, it's all about just separating so wa washi watashi ga kudu it's not not then to ga kudu watashi ga kudu. What do you think what the, this this part is meaning? They uh, come to me, yeah. Uh, I coming. Yeah. I I come. I have not mata watashi ga kuru. I have not come yet. Is what that says. Okay, yep. Yeah. So those guys do not think I so have not would not think that I have come yet. Renchi wa mada watashi ga kuru to wa omotte imai. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's all about yeah. mastering separating clauses in Japanese. Um, this part right here is also going mm -hmm. to go to you because I think it's a good one because you're not going to get a lot of stuff soon. Do I in nara to end o tori and there's like tsubahiro no boshi o aburu. Hi. What does toina mean? Uh, it's 
it so remember the nagara grammar point where it's like while doing so it's verb stem followed by nagara so eu uh, is so, a verb yeah eu is a, uh, we, we discussed it but it's it's been a few weeks i think or not maybe a few weeks but it's been a while yeah so yeah so verb stem which is mas form minus mas right uh mm-hmm. and then nagara at the end means while doing whatever the verb is so yeah. eu mas form would be uh e mas right the u becomes mm-hmm. e so verb stem is just e you know e twice so e nagara is while saying mm-hmm. so while saying that and then it's like he torus his tue and kaburus yeah. his boshi I forgot what to end in. I feel like I've seen it before, but I've somehow forgotten. It means forgotten. staff, like an old man staff. Okay, yeah, that makes sense now. Um, so he takes his staff, or okay, oh, takes yep. it along with him, and then... I don't know. Uh, what the... I think it's a wide-brimmed hat. So it is a wide-brimmed rat. Yep, and he kabuzes it. Hat, it. Yep. What does he do with his uh-huh. hat? Kaburu mean? Is he... Is he uh, Put on his hat or something. Yep, he puts it on. Kaburu okay. is the yeah. verb for putting on your hat. And Chris, last part. Yeah. Sure. Uh, so he says, uh, uh, patch off guard. Yeah, I think yeah. so. Yep, yeah, let's take him by surprise. Come, boy. Nobody was には um, so Nebody, he basically leads the way as he is crossing the courtyard at that. And the courtyard is very like muddy, and he's crossing this courtyard at a brisk pace. P- pace. He's very fast. Um, he goes down the stairs toward the um, secret tunnel, and with a grand gesture. He lifts his magical stone and says the magical spell, which made it that the, the, the fireworks get released and the gate opens widely and he goes through that like, like without any delay. Uh, okay, okay, I guess gallantly. <laughs> I ran up to catch up with him. Or I was running along with him. Um, Chris, your turn. あの、さ、ネバリ。ま、どうせ気を見つけ、あ、読み書きを習うのは分かったけど、他に勉強することって。あ、this um, interesting. Um, it, it feels like the whole thing should be in a quote. Yep. But I, I suppose he's just thinking to himself, he right? Is. Um, so he says, uh, hey, Nebari, um so I want to know more about um, how to look at magical stones and about school. Um, I know that I'm going to learn about how to read and write, but what else am I going to study? Hi. Yoika kozo, nebari wa tachidomari, surudoi me tuki de ore o mite, mata suta tsuta to aruki dasta. Yoika kozo. It's basically like, listen here. I would almost put that. <laughs> listen to me, boy. That sounds right. Um, Nebody stops his step and he looks at me with his sharp eyes. And once again, he be- then he once again he begins to walk with his brisk p- place. I think I read that wrong. Kamata. <laughs> once again, and then Cookie, your turn. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm so it's like I properly heard um So do you know what Shirushi yeah. means? No, I've never seen it before. It it is basically a symbol. 
So this is actually the reason mm -hmm. why he unazukus. So, and I think that's you know Zita means nodded or something, yes. yeah. So I nodded as a symbol mm -hmm. to show chanto kiteru. Which you did oh, translate that okay. right. Okay. Yeah, so um he nodded to indicate that he properly heard what yep. was uh being conveyed to him. Yep. And it's just, you know, present tense, so I am properly listening rather than heard. Um Chris, your turn. So he says, uh, you are not to call me Nebari. Uh, call me uh, master or teacher. Probably better. Uh, I don't know. What, what word would you choose for Shisho? Uh, I would probably... I don't know. It, it's like depends because master can be funny. <laughs> do, do master. Yeah, so, it can be kind of funny. I'd like, but uh, I maybe just teacher. Yeah. But it does mean like master, like shisho. <laughs> yeah, it it feels like like master feels a bit more dramatic um, in English. Vague in that and that yeah, but in that it could also mean just like 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 Khan could be a servant, but Absolutely. shisho is like undeniably teacher. But teacher doesn't feel grand enough. It doesn't. You know? Master teacher. So, that's my <laughs> dilemma. Yeah, just, master teacher. Just smash them together. <laughs> I guess the, uh, uh, so yeah, you are to call me Shisho. Uh, and so Khan says, or thinks to himself, what? Why? Your name's Nebri, isn't it? And then he asks why. Yeah. I think in the actual book, they do actually just use master. Because that does pop up in yeah. apprentices, apprenticeships, and the idea is that he's an apprentice. A deshi. That's true, yeah. Apprentice uh, master. But it's definitely, like, fallen out of practice these days. Uh, so it does make sure. it, like, a little more weird to use it. Um, I think mm -hmm. Cookie can try the next one. Might have some hard words. But grammar-wise, it's not that hard. So that's for me, right? Yes, Cookie, for you. Yep, so... Ore, anta no koto wa... And then it's like... Wait, 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 uh, wait, I've wait, seen wait. this. We just started this oh, page. We just started the page. Wait, we have? Yeah. Oh, on the right, yeah. Whoa, I got tricked so hard. Okay. Washi o sonke shiteiru koto o... I think that's a whiteboard you popped up. So, yeah, there you go. And then it's like... Sonke um, shiteiru koto And then I've seen that kanji, don't know the reading. Do you know what it means? I think it's to show. It is to yeah. show. Shimesu. Mm. Shimesu tame ni uh, kimatoro. And so I think that means, um, what does sonke mean? Sonke I've seen it before, I've forgotten respect. what it is. Respect. Respect. Uh, so, I try old. to show respect. Where, so look at the particles. Right? Look at the particles. Is it watashi wa or watashi o? What particle are we using here? It's wa washi o. So washi that means o. it's um. Mm -hmm. Yep, he's the object of the respect. He's receiving it. Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> <laughs> um. So. So in this case, you can say you. Oh my god. So he's, uh, I've he's got the words, I don't know how to glue them together. <laughs> I don't know how to glue them together. Uh, Maybe think show respect, something along the lines yeah, of that. Yeah, 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 that, that's what I'm thinking. Um, Do you know like, what the show me some is doing Because we've seen this in Magic Chaos. Uh, Annie's always kimaruing things in the beginning stuff. She's like, kimatteru wa? <laughs> it's like um, I always get this kanji confused with either change or decide. I think it it's decide. To decide. Um, in this case, it's like to decide, like God decided it or society decided it. So it's been decided that the shisho word is a way to simesu sonke toward your shisho, right? Mm hmm. So the main part, yep. important part of this is tameni, uh, and that. So, do you want to try throwing it all together then? 
if, if you can see me right now, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm rolling my hands in, uh. in a gesture. <laughs> There's like, um, okay, can, can you, can you like say it for me? So for the sake of indicating that you, which has been dropped out of here, that you respect me. Mm -hmm. It's been decided that you use shisho. Yep. Okay, so yeah, so it, it has been decided that you should respect me, yeah? Or yes. show some respect mm -hmm. for me. Yeah. yeah. Decided okay, by society. Okay, now it makes sense. Mm -hmm. So yeah, in English, we wouldn't even use kimateru. We just say, it's a way to show yes. respect for me. <laughs> but mm. you kind of need that yeah. extra verb in Japanese. Yeah, it's just to say mm. like that it's obvious, right? Kind of Why else? Obviously, you put the kami shisho. Mm -hmm. Um... Um, I absolutely respect you, you know. Um, it's not a lie at all. I truly do respect him. And Chris. Mm. Um, my turn? Yeah. Okay, I think we should start thinking about where to stop. Yeah, probably at the end of this page. Okay. Uh, 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 we all, we all know yada yada, that's it. <laughs> um, so, um, he says that this title, Shisho, um, is one that shows that I have um, knowledge, experience, and um, talents. Um, you know, it, it, it demonstrates that I, or, oh, that you don't have. Yeah, that's perfect. I was looking for that spot. <laughs> um, so, yeah, shows that I have, I have those things that you don't have. Perfect. Um, in fact, uh, I am your, your shisho, though. Yep. Um, and next is going to be Cookie. Uh, I think it's like Nebari, Betsu no Mono, Akeru, and then there's that. I think it's Aida. Yep. yep. Okay, good. Aida. And then it's Jikuri uh, to Tangaete Mita. So it's like. Nobody is doing. Uh, yeah, so he's thinking about... So we don't know what he's uh, thinking going... about. This is what he's doing. Yeah. Aida is so he's a going period of time. through the space of a different gate or Hi. something. That is open. Yeah. And that he... is open. That's and right. he's thinking while doing it. Jikuri is kind of like the think deeply, is how I would say that. Very careful, thoroughly thinking. So he's like, hmm. Yeah. Very, very much. Yeah. By, by your wording, I think you might have misunderstood that. I thought it's a, it's an interval of time. Yes. Not space. Well, it's. So oh, during I that. Thought, oh, mm -hmm. I thought Aida was like just um, a space, like you know, Ningen. It's um, both. Mm -hmm. That yeah. uses the same kanji. It does. See, yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. It's an yeah. interval of space or time. In this instance, it's time. Well, well the interval of time right. while he's opening the other door. Well, in Japanese, space and time is kind of in the same box kind of yeah, like tokoro sure. as well mm. it's also space and time so i'm pretty sure yeah, theoretically it's referring to both would be my, my assumption mm. that it's mm. when he's in the process of opening the gate with it's like kind of like mm. tends to involve both things but yeah that's true yeah. if you're translating mm -hmm. to english and you said the word space it would be wrong so you're correct in that aspect yeah Definitely. just how about how about yeah. we uh try and be um try, try and get it right the first time by saying space time space time <laughs> right so, so yeah he's in the space time of opening the door <laughs> hi <laughs> perfect right yeah but it doesn't really relate to the the physical place of like any area around the door yeah just so the activity right. itself yeah yeah then also anta ni wa nai chishiki to Keiken to sai no ga aru yo. Um, but 
for if you, it, but I um have talent, experience, and knowledge that you don't have, you know. So then, kozo yoba yoba wari sasete mo neburi no koto jiji to wa yoba nai si. And to me, you call me all you call me is kid brat. But I don't call you old man. Um, and cookie. And then it's like, uh, and then it's like, um, I've Shisho. never seen the second kanji. You have, it's Shisho. Uh, Shisho. 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 That's our word of the day. I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> Bloody idiot, me. Um, Oops. And I've just forgotten what it meant. Well done. Shisho. Can you can you use your can can you me? Shisho is a word that shows sonke toward nobody. <laughs> yep, nobody's uh, asking. It, call we, it. we called it um master teacher. Was our uh, okay? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I've heard it being said elsewhere. Um, but okay, it makes sense now. Um, and then it's like, uh, 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 is it wa or is it uh, uh, it's wa. Wa. Arumai. Wa. Arumai. Okay, uh, yeah, this part's <laughs> probably kind of too hard for you. Yeah. Uh, the my can be used to like oh, straight no. up replace my yeah or to replace my but you can also mm -hmm. have just the verb in dictionary form followed by my so like sudo my yeah. adu my kaberu yeah it's it's a nebari speak in his old man language but never so. mind um mm -hmm. like i and i think that washing our mind or she i think that means i'm your master yes something like that yeah and then adukoto and then it's like that's not going to change or whatever yes perfect yep and that those demo means like even if you say that and even if you say that you have talents i do not have it doesn't change the fact that i am your shisho fair enough あのさ、ネブリに追いつくためにこばしになった uh, um, In order to catch up with Nebidi, um, I started to trot um, なんなら俺の知っていることを教えてあげてもいいよ Well, if that's the case, then I can teach you things that you don't know And Chris お、お前がわしに教え、あ、あ、いや、教えられることがあるというのか。エバリーがまた俺をちらっと見た。例え、あ、いや、例えばなんだ。そうです。Oh. Um, there are things that you can teach me. Um, Nebari um once again glanced at me. So like what? I just think it's funny that Chirato just pops up so much in this book. It really does. Pretty common word. Uh, just so many glancing. Suri ya joma yaburi no yarikata toka, dare mo shirenai waki michi toka, kura gari no anpi ni aruku hoho toka, shite oite son wa nai yo. Um, I, I could teach you. I could teach you is dropped, but that's what the English needs it. Um, I could teach you about the way to pick locks, how to steal, um, passageways that no one else knows about, how to walk inside of darkness safely, and I promise you, knowing this stuff will not be a loss to you at all. You won't suffer from learning. Yeah, this. I think I would say it doesn't hurt to know. Doesn't hurt to know. That's a good. That's a much yeah. more natural way of putting that. <laughs> This is like a really, really long chapter, just because I know it's where I, I left off. So it's like one, two, three, four, mm -hmm. five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
So uh, it's definitely the longest, I think, of any of the chapters we've read so far. As of late, anyway. Wow. That's eight in total? Um, left? Eight, eight, eight more we need to read. Wow, that's like, we have more left than like the last few chapters were yeah. by themselves. Yep. I think it's like it's twice crazy. as long. <laughs> mm. yeah, we had some really, really short chapters. We did.